In this video, I'll show you the best way to keep Auto Start Stop disabled on your Ford Bronco. You'll need painter's tape, a T30 Torx bit with a ratchet, a 7mm socket with a ratchet, a non-marring pry tool, and a small pair of cutting pliers. We begin by removing the T30 Torx screws from the console handle. Once removed, set the handle aside. Protect the areas around the seam of the lower trim panel using painter's tape. Then, use a non-marring pry tool to release the top of the trim panel. Once the top is released, pull straight back on the right side of the panel to release the lower clip. Next, pull straight back on the left side to release the remaining clip and remove the panel. Lower the steering column closeout panel as shown. Remove the 7mm screw holding the left side of the HVAC panel. Lower the glove compartment door and remove the 7mm screw holding the right side of the HVAC panel. Use a soft towel to protect the center console, then pull straight back on the HVAC panel to release the clips. Hold down the release latch on the connector and disconnect the wiring harness from the auto start stop switch. Connect the harness to the auto stop eliminator, then connect the auto stop eliminator to the switch. Use a zip tie to secure the electronics housing to the vehicle wiring harness as shown. Trim the excess from the zip tie. Set the HVAC panel back into position. Reinstall the 7mm screw, then close the glove compartment. Reinstall the other 7mm screw, then reposition the steering column closeout panel. Replace the lower trim panel. Reinstall the console handle and tighten the screws to 48 inch pounds. Now that the device is installed, we'll start the vehicle and ensure auto start stop is off using the off indicator on the auto start stop switch. Next, we'll cycle the ignition to show the device maintains the off setting. We'll turn auto start stop on to show that this preference is also remembered.
Let's turn auto start stop back off and cycle the ignition one last time. It's that easy to keep auto start stop disabled on your Ford Bronco.